Say man, hey man. It's your boy Do It All Harlem. We're back with another NBA 2K24 Next Gen Build video. And today I have a special power forward build, man, that can play every position on the on the court, man. I, I'm talking about like guarding every position, the one through the five, you know what I'm saying? This build does have uh, great speed. You got great perimeter defense. You got super high steel on the build. You will be able to get the T-Mac base for the people out there that want it. You got gold rise up, gold fast twitch on this build. So anything around the rim, you will be dunking it and you have a 95 strength too so make sure you guys watch the video to the end so i can show you this masterpiece choose the hand of your choice and the jersey number of your choice let's get it man but before i go any further you already know what time it is if you don't know now you know it's like button time and i need you guys to go down and hit that like button get this video to 100 likes and if you haven't already hit the link in the description to join the discord hit the link in the description to follow me on twitch so with this build we're going with the power forward position like i said so uh even though you're at power forward now with this build they may not put you at center uh you may be stuck at power forward for real which is fine you know what I'm saying? Because you will be able to guard that position with no problem. And just in case y'all got a team that is full of um, full of guards and small forward, then they'll put you at center. Then, you know, I like that that option better. You know what I'm saying? Like, having a build like this at center is not bad. You know, you got a height disadvantage. Uh, but, you know, you still can hold your own if you know what you're doing, right? Uh, 246 on the weight, 74 wingspan. Let's get into it. Now, we're going to go ahead and start with the defense on this build because the defense is the most important part of this build, right? So, um, with a 6'7", you want to make sure that you have good interior defense. Now, this is one of the – I mean, I got like uh, um, a 6'8 build. Um, well, I got a 6'7 small forward that I be playing at center. Um, but it's not really equipped to play center, but I'll be playing at center sometimes. But I will make me another six foot eight similar to this, or I may go six seven at center, you know, just to test it out, you know what I'm saying? Like, just to see what I can do with a six foot seven center, you know what I'm saying? So, um, interior defense, we're going to take that up to an 88. Um, come to think of it, I may take this build right here and just put it at center. But me, I want a little bit of post going on my build. So we'll, we'll talk about that when I get to it. So we, we did 88 interior defense on this build so we can get all these bads right here that you see on gold. Okay. And what we did was we took the block to an 87. Now, um, I really wanted to go 6'8 so I can get a 92 block, you know, just to have that and, you know, kind of test it out. Um, I had a build with a 92 block at the beginning of the year. And, um, you know, you can get a lot of contests. You can get a lot of alter shots and things of that nature with that 92. So that's why I really like it. Uh, but this build, unfortunately, we couldn't get to 92 because we're 6'7". Uh, but we do have that 87 block, all right? Uh, now, we won't get gold on these bads. I'm thinking about 6'8". So anchor uh, will be silver. I'm sorry about that. Okay, so as far as the um, post-lockdown, that will be on gold. You know, we just got to take the strength up. We'll do that in a second. Uh, for, well, let's go ahead and do it now. Let's take the physicals up. You know what I'm saying? You can get the speed to an 84, but we're going to take it to an 80, um, 75 acceleration. Now, 95 strength on the bill. Whew, that's crazy. Um, in the vertical, we're going to take that up too. Okay, so now, as you can see, we do get gold post lockdown on this build and improve the defender's ability to defend the post move, right? So if somebody come down in the post trying to do that on you, guess what? You got post lockdown, you got brick wall, and you got a move enforcer. Three badges that will help you out against any center, right? Now, he's going to have the height advantage and may be able to shoot over you, but as far as, like, backing you down, you're not going for any of that. As far as the perimeter defense, we're going to take that up to uh, 88. Um, that does give us challenge on gold. We get 94 feet on gold as well, but we get clamps on silver, which is fine. Okay, as far as the steel, we're going to take that up to a 91 so we can get gold glove, gold intercept, and gold right stick ripper. Three great badges to have on this game, and I promise you, the type of animation you get with these badges on gold is amazing, okay? Um, as far as the block, like I said, we got an 87, so we get gold chase down on this build. We get pogo on silver, we get anchor on silver. So um, that's the thing about 6-7. We don't get these badges right here on gold. You know, if you were 6'8", you can get them on gold. You know what I'm saying? So that's something that I may do uh, just to get those badges right there on gold and really be a force in the paint, you know, and don't be, like, short arm and blocks and things of that nature. Like, it's some crazy animation that you get with an 87. Um, but for the um, rebounder, we're going to take the defense rebounder to a 93, and the offense rebounder is a 75. Okay, you can get it to a 78, but we just took it to a 75. So we still get – oh, we do get gold, Pogo. I'm tripping. I forgot about the rebound. <laughs> yeah, we do get gold pogo. We just can't get gold anchor. Okay, so we do get um gold rebound taste and hall of fame box, which is good. Um so this is really the the the, the best part of the build that I showed you first. And let me take the stamina up right quick too. So you can see that you do get um where is it gold 94 feet? You got gold workhorse, 
and things like that. So you're looking good with this bill. Now, we go to the shooting. This is another important part of the bill. A lot of people want good shooting, and a lot of y'all want their T-Mac base. So I made sure you had an 87 mid so you can get that T-Mac base. A lot of people want that, and I think it's very important to have. Um, it's one of the best bases in the game, either that, uh, J.R. Smith, or Corva. Those three right there are my top three uh, bases for um, like certain heights or whatever. You know, a lot of people using the padded meals that are smaller and uh, Malcolm Brogdon. And um, the Scotty Pippen one is good too. It's just fast as hell. You know what I'm saying? You just had to get used to it in certain game modes. But um, those are some great uh, shooting bases on this game. As far as the three point shot, we can get it to a 79, but we're just going to take it to a 78. Uh, we're going to do a free throw of a 72, and we still get some good shooting, man, as you guys can see. Um, nothing shabby about that, man. That open looks on goal is very, very important. We got mid and magician on goal. We got guard up on goal. We also get catch and shoot on goal. So you have some great shooting on this field that will allow you to go out there and make some shots with no problem, okay? But let's go ahead and get into the sauce. But before we do, I need you guys to do me a huge favor, right? Go down there, hit that like button, hit that subscribe button, hit that share button, and let the video play to the end because that will push the video to the recommended page so everybody mama can see this video. And I need everybody mama to see the video, so do that for your boy, boy. Now, as far as the pass accuracy, we didn't do too much on that, but we do got some passing uh, because we do have good rebound on the build. So we're going to have a silver break start, as you guys can see. We get a 75 pass, and some people complain about when I make the build with no passing. So I gave you guys some passing. Now, if you want to make it with no passing, that's up to you. But we got a 75 on this particular bill, right? As far as the ball handle, we're going to do a 40. Uh, for the speed with ball, that's going to go up to a 34, uh, which is not important. Okay, this whole part, the only thing important right here is the passing, to be honest with you guys. Now, as far as the finishing, so with the finishing on this bill, I have been testing some things out, you know, as far as like the drive and dunk. You know what I'm saying? Like, you could get away with the amount of driving dunk that we're going to have on this bill. So it's going to look a little crazy. So this is what we're going to do. We're going to take the standard dunk to a 92, right? And we're going to take the driving dunk to a 55. We got a 35 layup. Yeah, I know that's not nothing, but we ain't worried about that. We just worried about the standard dunk, being able to do standard dunks once you get to the rim. That's what you're out there for. We got rise up. We got fast twitch, and that's all we need, okay? I promise you, you'll be just fine with this 55 driving dunk. You get some dunk packages with this. And you should be good. We got 35 post control. It went up with the strength. So this is the build right here, man. We got a 99 on the shame now. Now, let's go ahead and get to these shades of are you ready? Because guess what? I do not click back. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Now, we got Dennis Rodman, but Dennis Rodman couldn't shoot. So um, we still have put him on the thumbnail for the hell of it. We got Al Horford. We got um, Scotty Bournes in the build. It's two-way spot up threat. That's the build. I'm out of here, man. Charge.